what is up this is another bitcoin magazine product breakdown video today we are going to be discussing the embassy from start nine labs as i'm recording this video start nine has completely sold out of all of their special edition launch embassies but the team is working hard to build the next batch to get out to all of you who want to run an easy plug and play private self-hosted server Today's video is really going to be about what the embassy is and what it provides you. The Start9 Embassy is a plug and play privacy device that allows you to run your own personal server. They've made it super simple for you to one click install and configure a growing list of powerful self-hosted open source services like Bitcoin, Bitwarden, Cups Messenger, and more. Getting into a little bit about the device, the Embassy is a Raspberry Pi 4 with four gigabytes of RAM and comes with 128 gigabytes of high endurance SD card storage, as well as a speaker for feedback. Let's hop in to the software. So uh, the Embassy software uh, is their main app. So as you can see here on my iPhone, uh, Start9 has created their own proprietary OS and app store, which you can own and authenticate with Tor for networking, installation, configuration, and hosting of the services. The OS is really uh, what the tech is built on and is the heart of what gives the embassy its user experience. You can access Ambassador OS through the Embassy app, which is a user interface and available for iOS and Android. And what's great about the setup is that all communications between the Embassy app and the Embassy itself are direct, private, encrypted, and anonymous over Tor. So you can see here in the app, I've got Bitcoin Core, Bitwarden, and Cups Messenger running. Uh, if you click on Get Apps, this brings you into Start9's uh, App Store. Uh, as you can see here, I have Bitcoin Core installed, Bitwarden, uh, and Cups Messenger installed from the App Store. These are currently the only apps that they have available, but Start9 is a brand new company. They're going to be developing a lot more software and services for the Start9 embassy moving forward. Uh, also, as you can see here, I have an update available for my Bitwarden server. All I'd have to do is click on this, and then ultimately I have the ability to update uh, right here from the application, which then updates uh, the, so the service on the actual embassy uh, itself. So going back to our main dashboard within the Start9 Embassy app, these are the services uh, I'm running on my personal server. Uh, for this video, I'm going to dive into Bitcoin Core and Cups Messenger. As I'm sure many of you are watching this video, you wanna see how you can connect your Start9 Embassy running Bitcoin Core so you can send and receive Bitcoin transactions through your own node. Uh, I've personally connected Bitcoin Core to Fully Noted, which is a free app in the Apple App Store. However, there are other wallets which you can use as well. Uh, it was very simple to set up. You really just need to grab three items from your Bitcoin Core application. So uh, as soon as you open up the Bitcoin Core uh, application, you're going to see your Tor address at the bottom here. So that's the first thing that you're gonna need. Uh, you can easily copy it right there. And then you're gonna need uh, your RPC username and password. Um, so to get there, click on config and then click on RPC settings, which will have your username and password. So now that you have those three items, you can go to the Bitcoin uh, wallet that you want to pair with your Bitcoin node. As I mentioned, I'm running fully noted on my iPhone, which I'll open up here. Uh, and then uh, when you open it, uh, you're gonna wanna click on the bottom right, which will bring you to settings, and then you're gonna click on node manager. Now I've already connected mine, as you can see, it's already connected, but for anyone who's starting out, you would click this plus button, uh, which is in the top right corner. Um, and then from that standpoint, you'll want to uh, add in those three items, which I shared, which is going to be the Tor address and then your RPC username and password. Now, uh, there's one thing that you're gonna wanna keep in mind uh, is you need to add the port to the end of your Tor address. So as you can see here in the one that I've already set up, uh, and the connection I've already made, I've added uh, on a colon and three eight three three two. 
So this is important to make sure that you add uh, colon 8332 at the end of your tour address uh, in order for uh, the services to uh, recognize and connect. Uh, so once you have that information entered, you're gonna see uh, in the fully noted dashboard here in the left uh, hand corner that I've uh, been fully verified and that the version of the I'm running uh, which aligns with the information in the Start9 Embassy app. Uh, you're going to see uh, now setting up a Bitcoin wallet is something I'm not going to show you for this video, but it's very similar to uh, any other Bitcoin uh, mobile wallet. Uh, you click on the second tab here within uh, Fully Noted, uh, and it's going to be able to see my active wallets. You can click on this plus button in the top left hand corner. Um, and it's very similar to any other Bitcoin uh, mobile wallet. You just uh, set that up. Um, and you uh, can create a new wallet which supports BIP39. Okay, so let's talk about CUPS. So let's go back into the uh, embassy application. Uh, CUPS is a proprietary messaging client which has been created for the Start9 Embassy and allows you to privately communicate with another person running CUPS. Uh, allegedly, this is one of the most, if not the most secure ways in the world to communicate with another person given it is fully encrypted running over tour and is person to person there is no third party involved at all not even start nine themselves uh, has access to this information uh and really just taking a step back about this device in general is you know the fact that if start nine has created this entire device and server uh in which you are fully in control not them so they can go belly up tomorrow and your services you're running on your embassy will continue to run uh, so let's hop into the CUPS application itself running on my iPhone. Uh, right now, the application is limited to just text, but the Start9 team is working on building out additional functionality like uh, photos and videos. It's pretty simple uh, to connect to another person. Uh, you just grab your tour address in the embassy application I was just in uh, and share that with another person that you want to connect with. Uh, they will click on this plus button in the top right hand corner uh, and enter in your tour address and then hit save and then a new chat thread. Uh, will appear simple enough and then you'll have uh, your, your chat threads that you're talking to people uh, with. So that's really what I wanted to show you guys today. Uh, if you really care about privacy and being more self-sovereign and getting away from large third-party uh, tech companies that are taking your data and profiting off of you, I can't suggest this device enough. Uh, this provides you more than just Bitcoin services. Uh, and I've been told by the Start9 team that they're working on adding uh, a ton of different uh, services, including uh, lightning functionality, personal email services, and all kinds of cool stuff. Uh, you know, check out their website for updates and uh, when they're gonna be uh, coming out with a new uh, amount of uh, embassies at start9labs.com. Uh, grab an embassy server, come meet them at Bitcoin 2021 in April in Los Angeles, where they're going to be exhibiting. Uh, for this Bitcoin Magazine breakdown video, this is JC. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Mm -hmm.